Hey, welcome back to Triple R. Today we're going to take a look at these Masters of the Universe uh, miniatures from Dollar Tree. So they're pretty good for a dollar. Let's check them out. All right, here we have the Masters of the Universe micro collection from Mattel. So I saw these at Dollar Tree, grabbed all the ones I could find. So we have Skeletor, He-Man, Merman, Orko, and Man-at-Arms. So this one's a little beat up. I think they mostly had, I guess the only ones that are hard to find for me were these two. One as common as the rest. Of course, I think Man-at-Arms is probably the most common because, well, I mean, nobody, nobody really liked him as a kid, I don't think. He's all right. All right, we're gonna open them up, see how the sculpts look. They look pretty good so far in the package, but for a dollar, I'm not gonna complain too much. I already know that I like them. Well, we can see how they stand up here. Yeah, that looks, looks pretty cool. Detail on the face. So I have to say, these look better than like the nano metal figs that I collect. The metal, the metal um, die cast ones, faces are all, always kind of bad. This looks good. All right, Skeletor. Yeah. Man looks here. Pretty good face sculpt. Kind of looks like uh, maybe Lou Ferrigno with blonde hair. Got the power sword. So the 2020s when they came out. Yeah, these are pretty cool. These look good. Merman, got a sword there. Yeah, those have those ridges. So that's cool. Good detail on these, for these minis. That's Merman. Orko, I never liked Orko. I don't like comic relief in cartoons like Orko and Snarf and stuff. They really annoy me in that little um, scooter robot off mask. Even like Bumblebee and uh, the human got on my nerves a little bit. But this is a good, good looking Orko. I'm kind of floating. I mean, probably don't want, want to know where that pole's going. Anyway. And then arms here, got the mace. Some detail on the armor. Looks pretty cool. Kind of shocked that um, it doesn't have Beast Man. It doesn't show like who's in the collection for this. So, of course, these two are the standouts. Especially Skeletor, probably the coolest looking one. Yeah, this mermaid looks really good too. Skeletor's crew always had cooler characters to me. Um, they had, you know, Trap Jaw, Triclops. So there is the Masters of the Universe. micro collection action figures well miniatures you can find at the Dollar Tree it's not much action because they don't move but they're pretty cool looking 
So if you're a fan, I would definitely pick them up. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.